Hi, welcome to the 3D Pen Den. We were just talking about setting up a 3D Pen Studio. One thing besides the 3D Pen and filament that you will need on day one and for every project afterwards is a 3D Pen friendly work surface. Wrong work surface can completely sabotage your project. If the plastic sticks too well to the surface, you might break the project, or the surface, or both, trying to get it off. If the plastic doesn't stick well enough, or at all, you just won't have any project to take off. Ideally, the piece should stay safely stuck to your surface until you decide to take it off, usually with some removal tool. Thin spatulas and palette knives work well for this. Surfaces are a complex issue and if you want to hear more, watch this video. And then also this one. The links are in the description below. The surface will obviously need to fit your project, but for the purpose of a two minute video, let's cut to the chase. The one surface I use the most is a piece of clear plexiglass sprayed with clear acrylic coating. Don't skip the spray step or you won't be able to get the plastic off at all. The good news is this coating lasts through many repeated uses before you need to eventually respray it. And in the meantime, the spray comes in handy anytime you need to make some other surface 3D pen friendly. Now, so far we have been talking only about two-dimensional work surfaces. So what about the third dimension? Don't we need a 3D surface to make 3D objects? Of course we do. But our two minutes are up, so we'll leave that for the next video.